Hi, I'm Jen Beeston. As a mortgage expert, all I do is talk about money with people all day long. And what I have found from this is that there's kind of a consistent issue that I think we can solve really easily. So it's very common in relationships for one person to be in charge of all the bills and the finances. And that can work really great for the relationship. Well, the problem comes if something happens to that person. And that's what I see on my end is, you know, I talk to people who are going through divorce or perhaps their wife is sick or their husband's died and they don't know anything about the family finances. So what I want to talk to you today about is a simple three page document. It might be more given your personal situation that you can put together that will make it so that if anything happens to you, your family has all the information they need to make sure that the mortgage is paid, that the lights turn on, that the tuition is paid. Um, and so that they know where your money is. You know, you'd be surprised how many people don't know where their money is or they go, well, my husband knows. Well, that's great. If your husband gets hit by a bus, you don't know where your money is. He just got hit by a bus. You know nothing. So this document will take care of that. So the first page is going to be all of your assets, checking accounts, saving accounts, who's your retirement with, how much roughly is in every account, what the account number is and what the contact information is. That's the first page. The second page is gonna be all your monthly reoccurring debts and your annually recurring debts. It's your recurring debts. So that would be like your mortgage, your cable, um, your internet, your cell phone, your water, your trash. I mean, all those things you can think of, you're gonna put them out and you're gonna get very granular. So if you're, if you use Comcast for cable, you're gonna write Comcast. You're gonna write how much you pay and you're gonna write down um, when it's due. Is it due on the first of the month? Is it due on the 15th of the month? And then you're gonna write down how you pay it. Do you pay by check? Do you have auto pay set up? If you have auto pay, what account is that tied to? And I would also suggest for any accounts where you're getting paperless billing that you note that and that you also give to your spouse or put in this document something that gives them that email address so they know what email address is tied to the account and what the password to that email address is. You just need to think about your personal situation, like if I disappeared tomorrow, how could someone pay the bills? How could they make sure everything's okay? And, and put it all in there. Your third page is gonna be your insurances, health insurance, life insurance, homeowner's insurance. It's gonna list all of those as well as monthly or yearly amount that you owe and how you pay it and the contact information. And I would suggest with life insurance too that you put what your coverage is. Um, the good thing about this too is I think that when you're looking at all these insurances, you know, you may, life insurance, you probably don't wanna get an updated renewal because it would be older, it'll be more expensive. Um, but you might wanna look at like your homeowner's insurance. Are you still getting the best rate for the coverage you have? Um, and is your home properly insured? But this three page, or if you have multiple assets or multiple debts, multi-page document really just needs to be an instruction manual for your spouse, partner, or child so that if something happens to you, they're not lost wondering where everything is. Because that's the last thing you want for them. No one wants that. You know, I, I've been talking to clients and it's so sad when you hear that they just don't know. They, they just really don't even know how to find the money. And it doesn't need to be like that. And I think that we always think about wills and we think about life insurance, but we forget about the very granular day to day and where is everything and how do I get to it? And the easiest way to do that is to put together the simple document. So I did put together a template. Um, it's not amazing. I mean, I'll work on my graphic design later, but if you want a copy of it, feel free to email me and I'll share it with you. But I honestly think that this document is one of the most important things you can put together for the people in your life. Uh, if you are the one in charge of the finances and if you're not in charge of the finances, I would urge whoever in your family is to please put this document together because I have seen the bad side of this and it's nowhere you ever want to be. So thank you for watching.